Hi my loves, welcome back to my channel, my name is Lisa if you're new around here. Today's video is going to be a little bit of a haul. So I've got a H&M haul that I want to share with you. It's literally been in the box for about a week and a half. I haven't had the time to film this but I've got it and I'm going to share it with you. A few little pieces that I've been buying. I haven't bought from H&M in ages. I feel like I haven't done like an online haul in so long so I thought I would grab a few pieces that caught my eye and share them with you today. And then also yesterday I had quite a few PR deliveries which I wasn't expecting. So I thought I would do like a little bit of a PR unboxing with you as well. So like a beauty haul of items so I thought I'd share that with you. Mother's Day is coming up so these might be nice little Mother's Day gift ideas as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with the PR unboxing and then I'm going to share with you the H&M haul. I am also waiting for an order today from Asda so if that comes in time as well I'll share that with you as well. Let's get into the video. I really hope you enjoy it. I hope you're well. Poor Orlando has had chicken pox this week which is not nice as you can imagine. Vinny and Renzo actually had it. Well Vinny had it when he was like three I think. Uh, and Renzo obviously got it as well and he was a newborn so I feel like Renzo could definitely get it again because you know if, you, if they get it when they're really young they could get it again so Renzo might end up catching it but Orlando's had it quite badly actually not I don't remember Vinny getting it this bad he's literally got it everywhere bless him so I'm really hoping that he feels better all of the blisters are starting to go now so I'm really hoping that he starts to feel better he's not as itchy so fingers crossed the oat baths I've been giving him like oat baths I've been giving him the Pyroton for kids and I've also given like had some creams and this foam to put on it. I think it's called Poxlin. Um, I found it on Amazon. Brilliant. I'm going to give him another oat bath after I finish filming this in a minute. And um, hopefully that will help soothe his skin a little bit. So yeah, anyway, let's get into the video. I'm going to start with this because this actually came the other day. Again, this is going to be a great Mother's Day gift idea. And it's from Neom. So I've got this gorgeous candle. It's called the Feel Good Vibes Scented Candle. It's got mandarin. Ylang ylang. Is it lang lang? or ylang ylang, ylang ylang, I don't know how to say that, and jasmine, um, and it says a scent to make you happy, which I just think is beautiful, the packaging is gorgeous, as you can imagine, Neom is always amazing, so this has got 100% natural fragrances to boost your well-being, an amazing gift idea, and this is such a huge candle, I'm not sure if they do this in like a smaller version, because it's like new, and I'm not sure if this is limited edition or not actually, but as you can see, it's a huge candle and it's just got a really uplifting kind of smell to it really lovely kind of the scent that you would you would expect in a spa very relaxing very pretty fragrance the next one is such a cool one so basically the other day when i was at my mum's we were talking about perfumes and fragrances because i was talking to her about that um how fetty that one from pen halligan so i was chatting to her about that because i had the little fragrance in my bag so she could smell it like the they sprayed it on a card for me and you can still smell it it's amazing actually so i absolutely love that but then she was talking about one of her favorite fragrances that I had given her a little while back I used to give her Roger and Galley stuff all the time like birthdays and things like that and um, she said oh my god one of the, my favorite fragrances is that Roger and Galley one that you sent me and I was like oh yeah such a lovely brand you can get it in like Marks and Spencer's and places like that so they've sent me this gorgeous package and can you see that at the top it's an actual cake an actual cake this is so cute so I'm really appreciative of this thank you so much when I opened it the fragrance I could smell it straight away and it's rose oh my god guys this is so so cool so they sent me a well-being shower gel look at this for starters the packaging is gorgeous isn't it there's also a body lotion to go with that one which looks like this a soap I think that's what I could smell actually it's a soap the rose scented soap and then they also sent this so it's like a little gift set and in there you've got the scented ritual, you've got a little perfume and a hand cream. My mum absolutely loves a little hand cream. And look at this little bag. Sorry, what? I absolutely love this colour. That is so cute, isn't it? So you've got this hand cream here, which is just the perfect size for your handbag. And also this fragrance. That is what the fragrance looks like. This cake is literally like the soap. How cute is that? Love that from Roger and Galley. Available now from the French pharmacy from £6.95. Um, so there you go, Roger and Galley. Whilst we're talking of like scents and fragrances, I did receive as well yesterday a box from Floral Street. And as you know, I absolutely love their fragrances. There's one that they've got and it's really like lemony, citrusy, which I absolutely love for the summer. It reminds me a little bit of Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue, which reminds me of my mum, because she always used to wear that when I was little. So they sent me some more fragrance, which I was so excited about. So we've got Floral Street Sunflower Pop 
This again is so funny because does anyone else like remember this photo? This like artwork and does, I mean, did we all have this print in our home when we were younger in the 90s and um, early 2000s? Because I did. <laughs> My mum had this in the entryway, this exact print. That is so funny. So yeah, sunflower pop comes like this. Uh, like that. Then you just open the front and there is the fragrance inside. This one is gorgeous. Again, this one reminds me of the one that I used to love, whatever, it, whichever one it was. I can't remember what it is, but if I looked at the packaging, it was like blue. Very fresh, citrusy kind of fragrance, this one. What does it say on the box? Let's have a look. So this one says, a citrus fruity fragrance for the bright, expressive, vibrant and happy. Love that. A lot of my fragrances tend to be very, either very sweet or very heavy like I like quite masculine scents usually but as spring and summer comes along I like to feel fresh I like to feel like you know that fruity citrusy vibe which I love so that is really cool they're also in the package was the floral street sweet almond blossom perfume so we've got like a small one that you can put in your bag this is a 10 mil one but yeah love that one that's gorgeous and also they sent me the sweet almond blossom room fragrance got that one as well I didn't even realize that they did like room fragrances i thought they just did perfumes so that is really good to know so if you've got like a favorite like scent that you love you can get them in the room spray as well final two bits are skincare items so we've got something from clinique here this is the smart clinical repair spf wrinkle correcting cream so spf 30 this one is i'm really like getting back into my whole skincare thing at the minute that is what it looks like you should still put an spf on as well but the fact that it's got it if you haven't got any spf then at least you've got a little bit of that protection there as well. So that is what I got from Clinique. And then my final PR package today is from L'Oreal. This Mother's Day, L'Oreal Paris is celebrating all the mums and mum figures in our lives because all mums are worth it. So we've got a bunch of products in here. Um, so I'm definitely going to be sharing these products out, you know, with my loved ones. Um, so we've got the L'Oreal Paris Age Perfect Cool Renew products. We've got the Midnight Eye Cream midnight serum i do love l'oreal skincare products actually they're really brilliant we've also got the midnight regenerative regenerative cream recover skin barrier 1.5 percent faster wrinkles firmness comfort that one there there's a couple of products here so this one is for age 60 plus i didn't even know they did this so it targets for age 60 plus so age perfect golden age rosy radiant care um anti-sagging targets dark circles so this one is for mature skin how fabulous is that these would make a really beautiful mother's day gift if you pop that into a hamper thank you so much to l'oreal thank you to everyone that sent those if you're watching very very kind of you i really hope that you you enjoyed seeing as well like the new products that are out at the moment i really love seeing what's new so that was my little pr unboxing now let's get into the h&m haul so i've got a few little bits i don't like to go overboard when i order from h&m because i don't like to send things back it really annoys me so i've had a little look what's in here but i haven't opened it up or tried anything on so let me just show you what i got why i got it and yeah let's get into it right the first thing i got i'm so so excited about i have been wanting a bag like this for so long i came across this brand called flattered and i saw their bags i think it was on um, facebook you know when you get like served ads on facebook and i loved the look of the bag and i was i was at the time i was looking for you know a bag that's just a little bit smarter i wear my uniqlo bags all the time and i've also got like a primark um, version as well but sometimes i want a bit more of a smarter bag to wear when i saw this one on flattered this one i was like yes i absolutely love this that's the bag there look it's 219 pound so i was like mm, i'll just wait and we'll just i'll just wait and i just didn't obviously end up buying it because you know 200 pound for a bag i was like nah anyway i went on h&m the other day and then i saw this bag which i'm sorry but it's quite a good little dupe isn't it this was like 29 pounds 29 pound or 200 pound what are we saying i mean also i love that it's got the long strap because i am a crossbody bag kind of girl also you can just hold it like this and you're just looking really chic you know like under your arm i love it so gorgeous the fact that it's got no fuss just makes it look so much more expensive than what it is so i'm really 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 happy with that i love it let's see what it's like inside there's a central pocket inside so ideal for your like phone and stuff and then you've got space on either side for things as well this is just gorgeous i'm really happy with it it's exactly what i needed and what i was like lacking in my accessory wardrobe so that's 
that's gorgeous isn't it absolutely love that yeah so that's the crossbody bag it was only 27.99 and it also comes in like a beige color as well like a camely color which is gorgeous and there's also the arquette version on the website which is 179 pound 179 or 27 i think we'll go for the 27 one i then got a shacket i feel like it's shacket season isn't it now sometimes when you're just popping out it's just nice to wear a shacket and i don't have one in this color and i just feel like this is really nice very easy versatile nice color it's kind of like a khaki green color almost i'm not sure how this is going to fit what size did i get i got a medium oh no i feel like that's going to work really well it's not really going to work with this jumper because i would usually wear i would wear like a t-shirt underneath it rather than a knit but here we go i feel like that is so nice it's a great size great fit i got mine in a medium as you can see it is like super oversized but i feel like this color works really well on me do you think i feel like this is nice with silver accessories i'm going for silver i feel like silver's back you know I like mixing silver and golds, but sometimes I just feel like silver adds a bit of brightness. Do you know what I mean? These are actually from H&M as well. I got these when I was in London, but I love this. I'm really happy with that. I feel like the color is really nice. So yeah, got that as well. Let me see how much that one was for you. Cause I can just look back on my order, can't I? So that was 19.99, oversized denim shirt, size medium. Dark grige is the color. Yeah, this is, this is gorgeous. I'm really chuffed i like the fact that for this haul i've not like gone and ordered loads of things i've just ordered things that i feel like are going to work in my wardrobe i feel like sometimes i can pick really good pieces that work for me and are my style so really happy with that really happy with the bag i feel like that even works the bag nice little white t-shirt underneath the shacket bag across with maybe some like um ecru mum jeans some nice trainers I feel, I feel like that would be a lovely outfit. I did also order a cap because I'm just a cap kind of girl. I'm going on these little couch to 5k runs. I feel like I have to wear a hat because if I wear my hair slick back, I look like an absolute potato, a thumb. It's just not, it's not giving. And I can't put my hair in a bun when I run because obviously it just, I don't do like tight buns for my hair. I never wear my hair tight. So what I do is I wear my hair in a low ponytail and then I wear a hat like a cap i feel like that looks better so i got this one i'm loving this kind of washed denim i just love it looks a bit vintage so i went for this gray um hat love this this is a bit of me let me see if it's gonna fit because sometimes the hats just don't really fit oh okay yes this is good also i like hats to tuck my ears in you know i've got a problem with my ears but that is nice isn't it love that hat really happy really good this is turning into a really great haul i'm really glad i waited to share it with you okay so the next thing i got was just a couple of um cushion covers because i've still got two cushions downstairs that have got like a christmas cushion cover on it i just thought i can't really continue the rest of the year with christmas cushion covers so i just got two of these plain beige ones i just feel like they're gonna be okay also they're like not a fabric that are gonna cling cat hairs on because i can't really go for like the whole velvet thing anymore because cat hair and velvet is not really a good combination and it is shedding season at the moment for the cats so this fabric is great it's a little bit like a like a linen fabric i would say very nice very cheap um i just needed two of those so i can replace those christmas ones i then got um a t-shirt now i'm hoping this is going to fit Vinny actually although yeah i feel like we might just get away with it this was in actually the i feel like this is the men's section it's the h&m move range i got it in an extra small they didn't do extra extra small obviously Vinny is only what he's going to be 11 soon but he does fit into like 12 to 13 age clothes, which are quite big actually. So I thought maybe an extra small might fit him. Got him this as a PE t-shirt because it's just that material, you know, like a football t-shirt. It's that material that doesn't crease. And my kids, honestly, they will shove their t-shirts into their bag and there'll be so many creases in those t-shirts. And I'm like, oh, are you serious? Like, do you know what I mean? I've just like ironed that so and like when they put it back in their bag after pe i just thought you know what i'm gonna get in one of these this material is fab doesn't show up any creases so you know if i don't have time to iron we're just putting this in the bag and it's ideal so i got that for Vinny. i feel like that will fit him to be fair and then i got these ones for did i get these for renzo yes so i got these for renzo these are in the eight to ten 
um, which are going to fit him. So this one's a little bit more of a creamy white. It may be a little bit more ivory, but it is slightly ivory, but it, it will work. Again, I'm going to use that for him for PE. This, this one came in a pack of three though. So we also have it in black. These are great. My boys live in sports t-shirts and shorts literally live in them and these are a great fabric like i said they don't crease which is just ideal isn't it and this also comes in this gray as well yeah love that really great quality perfect for my boys because like i said they live in sports stuff also got them some sports socks as well i never used to buy black sports socks but sometimes an outfit calls for black sports socks and actually the boys love wearing them so i got them a pack of three they've got two packs so one for renzo one for vinnie these ones are Vinnie's. Got some socks as well. And that will conclude this haul. That is literally everything that I got. If I get the other bits today, I will share them with you. Right guys, it's a few hours later. I wanted to show you my Asda delivery because it just came. I ordered this on next day delivery. It's just a jacket. I am literally obsessed with this jacket. It's so nice. I got it in size medium. It's like a quilted oversized jacket. I literally love it. The colour is so nice. So this is what the jacket looks like. I'm literally so happy with it. So I thought I would quickly pop on to show you it. I'm gonna link it because hopefully it's not out of stock by the time this video goes live. Like I said, I've got it in a medium. It's also got like a pull cord on the inside so you can kind of pull it in and create a little bit more of a bomber style if you like. I really like um, like a boxy fit. So for me, it's perfect just as it is. But yeah, so happy with it. Absolutely love it. I've also put it on with like my new hat which is the one that I got from H&M. So this is it with like the hat and then also with my new bag. I love it, I think it looks so cool. 35 pounds this is, just 35 pounds, what a bargain. Such good quality as well. Love it. But yeah, thank you so, so much for watching guys. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video and having just a little bit more of a chit chat with me and a little bit of a random collective haul. I like doing these every now and again, but thank you so much for watching. Thank you for bearing with me. I've had a bit of a crazy week this week because obviously Orlando's not been very well, bless him. I'm gonna go run him at oat bath now so we can have a lovely bath and just relax and chill and soothe his skin. So yeah, before I go, I do wanna mention this jumper because this is the softest jumper ever. It's a soft, really soft knit, no itchiness. Like knits, I am really funny with. I don't like anything that's itchy. This is so glorious. And look at the sleeves. They've just got a little bit of like looseness to them, but not too much. They're a really lovely length. They just come down a little bit which is gorgeous so you know how i love a side split on my jumpers just because i feel like it gives me a little bit more flow it's just a little bit more flattering this one's actually got a split at the back you've still got that movement but it's not there's no side splits on it so this jumper it comes in loads of different colors they also do matching um shorts with it as well so i'll link this one for you this one's from amazon i absolutely love it it's so so comfortable um but yeah absolutely love that one thank you so much for watching i will see you all in my next one Bye guys.